We welcome you back to our continuing coverage of the 2013 America East Men's and Women's Basketball Championship presented by SEFQ, our third quarterfinal on the men's side. The regular season champions, Stony Brook, taking on eight-seeded Binghamton University. Stony Brook in the home white, Binghamton in the road black, and the opening tip is controlled by the Seawolves, and we're underway here at UAlbany. You know, zone defense, as we see the Bearcats on this first possession, have been what they have done all season long. Coach Dempsey feels it was the best way for them to guard him. And the best way to attack a zone is to shoot over the top. And Scott King, a three-point shooter, makes his 19th three of the season. And he wants what the zone defense has given the Bearcats for most of the season. Quality defensive rebounding. Jordan Reed, four points, averaging better than 16 a game. Reed, got it. That's the mid-range going to his right hand. Oh, Mike Horn set to put it into play for the Bearcats as you take a look at the numbers in the first half. Stony Brook has it up to 45% from the floor during this 9-2 run. They've raised that shooting percentage. This will be an interesting challenge for the Seawolves. They're going to allow, you see a little bit of double team on the ball screen and rotate. Nice job. Jackson with the steal. Gray back defensively. Jackson with the finish. Alling tries to spin, yeah. goes out to Gray, deep three, is good. Well, Javon put the ball on the floor, the defender on Jimmy Gray, I think was Anthony Jackson, went to help out, created an open look off the pitch. He's banged in their first three in the ball game. You got Jimmy Gray and Taylor out there, both deep three-point shooters. After missing the first eight three-point attempts, Gray comes through. Now Binghamton needs stops and plenty of them. King tries to answer and he does. Deep. In this program at Binghamton, fans choice. You see Javon Rawlings score in the low post, but fans love Jimmy Gray, obviously the local hero. They traveled here to this tournament, but the season will come to an end today for Binghamton after an impressive performance by Stony Brook. 72-49 will be the final.